Bones, get ready. One looks good if you ask me, but it's locked, isn't it? Uh, who would have guessed that? We should start with the corpses, I think. There has... There has to be some. What about Brother Yarber? Declined. Just like the others. If you would maybe just explain to them what we need those bodies for, I would not justify for, myself might... to those fools. If they only had a trifle of decency, they would see the debt they are in. But, as they wish. There are other ways. Tell the other servants that I do not want to be disturbed for the rest of the evening. And bring me new salve. The salve? Of course, Master. Walk blessed. To be someone with a key. Um, are you alright, Saira? Wait, you mean in a vision? But how? I thought everything you see comes from the Pyrean Age. Hmm. That would explain why he hired so many hunters from the village. But what did he need all those cadavers for? The angel? <sighs> Whatever. Let's go search those bodies for a key. Wait. Did you hear that? To be someone with a key. Um, Kirash. vision must have caused this. We should be prepared for resistance now. Come on, let's find that key. I don't want to have to look at this. Do you have it? Then let's go in. Good. Let's see if we can get through the main hall somehow. Then we'll see.
Careful. A sight. Do you see anything? No, but I suppose Dalgalar's personal quarters would be a good place to start. I guess the big gate over there should lead us there. Let's take a look. This is some kind of magic seal, similar to the one the Magisters once showed us in the Scuola. You need to speak the correct word in order to pass. Two of them, it seems. Well, that's the question. But knowing Del Galar, I'm sure he chose two words that meant something to him. So if we can somehow find out more about him and what he did here, we might have a chance. If not... We'll need to look for another way in. Come, let's take a look at the two towers. I think the staircases in this hall might lead us there. This must have been some kind of laboratory. Enemies. 
This must have been some kind of laboratory. was all of them. Forgive me, Master. I wanted to talk to you. Uh, of course you do. What's on your mind? I... Forgive my words, but I find certain recent developments disquieting. Do you? You've changed, Master. Every day the villagers bring their sick to our gates, but you forbid us to let them in. Instead, you spend every minute with this... With this girl, and the Black Stone. Haven't you heard the tales? The stones are cursed. Master, you really should... Go and pack your things, Yulika. What? Master, I am just worried about you. I know, and I thank you for it. Now go. Your apprenticeship is over. But... Go! Scientia Sinestra by Ibn Karim. Hmm. That was a Kyranian Arcan. His Zimnota. Getting caught with one of these books is essentially a crime here in Anderal. Seems that Dalgalar needed more than just alchemy and light magic for his angel. Stuffed creatures. Even lost ones. I'm not surprised he had their differences.
What the? That's not a laboratory, that's a crypt. Hirosh. Now we know that he didn't just stick to animals, but what is this fluid they're floating in? Hmm, I see. Do you see that? A crystal, but it's so dull. As if all its energy... Energy is life, and energy is death. A trifle less, not too much less, just a little. Don't disappoint me, not this time. from it. Maybe that was some kind of experiment for what he planned to do with the Black Stone? What? But to what end? If this device were some kind of prototype for the Angel, what did he hope to use it for? This only gets more confusing. Come, let us look for the second code word. Maybe it's around here somewhere. Anything? It does? Show me. Hmm. So Dalgalar had a daughter. And this Tanisha must have been his companion? His paramour? Yes, but why the heck would cold mountain air be good for a sick child? At least now we have another candidate for the code words. Tanisha. I doubt we'll find anything else here. Good. Come on. Good. Then let's try our luck with these sigils, shall we? You do it. Yes, that sounds good. Okay, so we have one word. Now let's take a look at the other tower. Maybe we can find the other one there. More bodies. What in blazes happened here? Enemies, get ready. <gasps> now just what the heck was that? Yes, probably, but what is it? That's not an elemental, at least not a common one. <sighs> Let's just be careful. I don't like this. Thank you. 
A barrier. Mm -mm. That looks like Starlingcraft to me. Without... It is impossible to banish the barrier, correct? Yes, my son. And no one apart from us knows the letter. I see. Then I owe you my thanks. We should make a toast. To your Matrillion Brandy? I, um... I must confess that I have no friend to alcohol, but... Thank you nonetheless. Hmm. Oh, oh it's a place this with it. What are we drinking to? Our collaboration? To our collaboration. At a world free of suffering. Oh, um, all right. To our collaboration. And a world free of suffering. Really. Between us, Miza, why the barrier? What do you have up there that five arm wides of north wind stone aren't enough for you? Something that's very dear to me. I'm very fragile. Um, I see. Well, then I can assure you that. Ah, uh, blistery, blazes. How tired I suddenly am. All that work, it, it must have gone to my head. Yes, my sir. You should rest. And forgive me. I will take care of your family. You have my word on that. What... what, what do you mean? I just have to... <laughs> I am sorry. Knowing how it works, we'll have a hard time getting through here. What? You had another vision. Poisoned? Why? Hmm. Yes, probably, but killing someone just because of that? This must have something to do with the angel, however. Question is, how do we get through here? Let's take a look around. There must be another way. Maybe we could kill the mechanism that runs the barrier with force? But... Hmm, wait. Yeah, I snatched a bag of black powder earlier when we carried the barrels up to the gate. I thought it might come in handy. Here, Magistro Jaela gave me this scroll not too long ago. You... And a fire arrow will take care of the rest. Try to throw the pouch through the breach. That has to... See if you can shoot a fire arrow through the breach so it drops onto the mechanism.
Try to shoot from an oblique angle. Otherwise, the arrow will bounce off in the wrong direction. Let's hope the fire doesn't spread. Now let's go see what Dalgalar wanted to hide so badly. substance everywhere. Huh. This must have been this room. Let's take a look around. No, please don't eat me. The Vatir eyed him and sneered. Why wouldn't I? You are weak and I am strong. His voice was coarse like a whisper tree's bark and you don't like this story, do you? <sighs> of course not. You didn't like it when Mother read it to you either. But do you want to know something, my little starlet? Soon, you'll be warm again. And then there will be no more need for stories. Because you will be able to go out yourself and explore this world on your own two feet. I promise you, Maya. I promise you. Girl was dead, Sierra. She was dead. There, Dalgalar's acquisitions. Now guess what else apart from animal bodies he bought heaps of. Dewflowers, lavender, and shadow stem oil. These are the ingredients for the ointments the Kileans use to embalm their dead. The Kileans use it to keep a body fresh before sending it to sea. And didn't you tell me he ordered his apprentice to get him his salve? Dalgalar's daughter wasn't ill when he brought her here, Saira. She was dead. And he used this balm to preserve her like a piece of salted meat. This is... This is... Yes. He wouldn't accept her death and thus lied to his wife. And this device we saw in his laboratory must have been how he intended to resurrect her. But now it all makes sense. This must be the true reason for Dalgalar's work on this angel. At least now we have a good candidate for the code word. Maya, yes. Come. Good. Then let's try our luck with these sigils, shall we? You did it. I can't believe we actually did it. His sanctum. Unbelievable. Just look at all these books. I wonder how much Nala is hidden here.
Enemies. Ready. Sa'ira. Gurual Ninto Jaros. He who is patient always finds a way. I was starting to worry that you two little birdies would never part. So it wasn't just my imagination. Yes, you have been followed. Thanks for opening the gates, by the way. That saved us a lot of effort. Quite the feat, I must admit. Ah! Oh, but... <laughs> now look at that. You don't waste any time talking. Hmm, I like that. Then I'll Kira, return the Kira, favor. what is this? Let me go, you bastard! This, my little bird, is mentalism perfected. Because this time, someone was less willing to take risks and decided to send capable soldiers rather than those idiots from Old Ration Brand. Now don't look so grumpy, sweetheart. You're up next. And I promise we'll have just as much fun with you. The king of the fabled empire of old, Aranath, of course. Save yourself the stupid questions, dear. Now don't look... Take her, my friends. But careful, understood? I want her alive. I'll see to that. The stone, Sa'ira. Find the stone and then run. 